Now, the federal government has been urged to address the issue of congestion in the correctional centers across the country and also make available adequate rehabilitation programs for inmates. A group under the aegis of Hetford Foundation, which offers free legal services for persons awaiting trials in some of the correctional centers in the country, said this while launching My Right, My Freedom project. Now, founder of the foundation, Oluyemi Orija explained that the project seeks to enlighten members of the public about their rights as a way of ensuring their freedom. Why I've said that is I've been in this now for three years officially and I can tell you that when we take these cases they tell us a story. We don't rely on that story alone. We do not take that story away. We go and go to the court, take their file, look at their file, or just oppose what they have said to what is in the file because this is what is in the file, in the file that really matters. So when you read through the file, look at the statement that they wrote at the police station, which, has, which is that the heat of passion, when that um, incident actually happened, you'll be able to know that indeed this person was innocent. So the project is still teaching you about fundamental human rights. It's teaching you to know your rights because even some of us as learned persons do not know what our rights are. So we are explaining to people, this is your right. So when you get to the police station, for instance, if you are being arrested and they ask you, um, they have written a statement for you and they tell you, sign it. You can bluntly say no. Meanwhile, former chairman of the Nigerian Bar Association, Ikeja Chapter, Adishina Ogulano, described Nigeria as a jungle where powerful politicians and those in power are always right before the law. Ogulano, who lamented that Nigeria is an unjust country, said that the situation might not change anytime soon. Let the adjudicatory uh, agency, that is the court, let them do their work and then let the prison system hold only those people who are truly guilty and that and that so when you have margin of error it should be little you can't have a perfect system but it should not be a system where 80 percent 80 percent is error and 20 percent is merit that is bad and that's the system that we have and the only way you can change that is not by preaching to government it's by making them to do the right thing and the people to, I'm actually asking for a rising of a revolution, whatever, whether of ideas, whether of electoral revolution. Now, the foundation has successfully secured the release of 244 inmates awaiting trials at correctional centers in Lagos. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.